Hi, Facebook family. This Hi. is Amberly Vogelsang. I'm Amy Wade's National Sales Manager, and I'm joined here with our wonderful COO and President, Amy Niccolo. Hi, everybody. And it's Fungal Disease Awareness Week. So we really thought this would be just kind of like a great opportunity for us to um, address some of our top conditions, which nail fungus is one of them. And we're gonna show you exactly how to use the product for nail fungus. We have a, i.e. myself, a fungal diseased toenail that I've been treating with emuoid. So we'll show you exactly how to apply it, what the product is, and we'll kind of get into um, all of those tips because I know that's one of our frequently asked questions is just how do you use the product? How does it work? All of that jazz. Right, and so 20% of the U.S. population has nail fungus, and about 75% of people over 60 have nail fungus. So it's a very common condition, and oftentimes it's chronic. It's difficult to treat. There are lots of over-the-counter medicines out there, and there are prescription drugs as well. Many of them don't have great success rates. Often they have really serious side effects and are risky to use. Uh, so Emuate is a great alternative. We're a homeopathic product, it's all natural, and there are no side effects. So with consistent, regular use, you will be able to kill the fungus on the toenail and have a healthy, pink, lovely toenail regrow in its place. And we're going to show you how to do it. Um, before we start, I want to show you, this is the product you use for nail fungus. This is the Emuade Max. It's the maximum strength version of our first aid ointment. We also have a regular strength, which is in the blue jar. When you purchase this in stores, it comes in the unit carton. When you purchase it directly from us on our website, it doesn't come in the carton. It comes just in the jar. What's inside is the same. We just try not to use extra packaging when we can avoid it. And inside, either your package that you get shipped or in the box is this. And this is your little Bible of all things Emuade. It'll tell you how to use Emuade for the condition you're treating. So there's detailed instructions on how to use it for nail fungus, but there's also detailed instructions on how to use it for 100 other skin conditions. Yeah, exactly. So again, frequently asked questions are on the back, but on the front here, there's instructions for how to use it for some of our top 25 conditions. So a lot of people come to us maybe using it for nail fungus, but then they'll say, oh wow, it works for skin tags. And everyone's just always, it's so funny, everyone's just always so shocked about like, oh my God, it works for all of these things. Um, but for nail fungus and for basically any of the conditions that we treat, consistency and frequency of use is absolutely key for effective results. So the minimum of three times a day for most conditions, especially nail fungus. Right, fungal infections are pretty opportunistic, so they're difficult to treat in terms of just getting uh, consistency and destroying the fungus and then preventing it from reoccurring, especially on your feet, which are often in closed-toed shoes and socks, they get sweaty. It's just like the perfect environment for fungus to really kind of take hold. So for a chronic fungal infection, three times a day minimum, I know it's hard. We all talk about how difficult it is to remind ourselves to use the product as regularly as you need to, but if you really want to treat the infection, which you did not develop nail fungus overnight and the disease toenail overnight, it takes time and consistency to also treat it. So we're going to get into the nitty gritty here and show you Amberly's toenails. Yeah, so let's take a look at my toenails. Um, and this is the most common thing that everyone always asks us about. Let's see if we can uh, get that in there though. Okay. Yeah, so as we can see here, this is my toenail. Um, right here, right that part, that's a little bit of yellow still, and that's normal because that part of the nail is basically dead. It, it is dead in a sense. Um, and the pink healthy part, that's what you're gonna be looking for. You're gonna be looking for that really pretty pink nail growth coming in right there. As long as you're seeing that, that is meaning the product is working, the new healthy nail bed is growing in, and it's killing the fungus, allowing that new healthy nail growth. Now, how long have you been treating your toenail? A, when few, did you a few months. I've been treating mine a few months. Mine happened from an injury. So nail fungus can happen from a few different ways. So I want to point this out though. So when Amberly started using the product, all this yellow, dead, damaged discoloration was all the way back here at the cuticle line. And what's happened is as she's continued to apply the emuade throughout the covering the entire nail, the nail is starting to grow out. So she still has that damaged discoloration, although we believe the fungus is completely dead. She still has a damaged toenail. It, it, you can't repair a dead nail. But yeah. what's happening is this is all the healthy nail growing in. So since she's been applying, she's had this much regrowth. 
it's all pink and healthy. There's the white line here, and you can see almost the, the delineation between the dead, damaged nail and the healthy pink nail. This is the sign that you have killed the fungus and your healthy nail is growing out. And something I also want to mention um, is our product is all natural, so it contains no acids, no bleaches, and nothing to actually alter the color of the nail, only to make it healthier and to allow that healthy nail growth out. So I opened up the product already. When you do get the product in, it's going to have a safety seal. It's going to have a tamper-proof seal. You're going to take all that off. And I love to use these precision Q-tips for treating nail fungus when applying it. It has that little pointed tip on it, so it allows you to kind of get the product on a finer tip and allows you to get under the bed as you'll see it here. So I'm just kind of putting it in here, coating the Q-tip really well. If you guys can see that, coating the Q-tip in the jar really well. And then all I'm doing is just covering it, light coat on it. Again, it's a precision Q-tip, so I try to go in there a little bit underneath. You don't want to try to shove a Q-tip under there at all. We do recommend if you are able to keep the nail trimmed. So try to continue to trim the dead nail as close as you can as the nail is growing out. It's also great to treat all the nails, even if they aren't suffering exactly. from nail fungus. But every time you treat a nail, use a new cotton tip. Exactly. Do not reinsert the used cotton uh, swab into the emuate or back onto a healthy nail. Just in case there is any type of living fungus, you don't want to spread it. Exactly. So I just use this this Q-tip end right here. So all I'm going to do is just flip over and dip this side into it. And that's really just for, you know, hygienic purposes. You don't want to be dipping a Q-tip into a no jar. No double dipping. No double dipping. And then I also treat my other nails just to be on the safe side. It keeps them nice, keeps them shiny, keeps them looking good, keeps the nail growth looking good. And then that's everything. And that's how you apply it. So we have customers who tell us that they see results within a few applications on nail fungus. That is not necessarily uh, the normal result. What you may see is a really improved appearance of the nail because Emuate is going to moisturize the nail, it's going to make it shiny, it will take away any, it will start to take away some of the discoloration, it's going to kill the fungus. So you may see an improved in appearance pretty quickly. But I did. I saw great improved appearance. Sure, but it, but to actually really yeah. treat the nail fungus and treat the condition, you need to use the product regularly. For some people, it can take up to three to six months to really have a full nail grow out and have the fungus completely be gone. So consistency, stay with it. Um, certainly, we recommend uh, supporting your immune system. And we have a probiotic that is designed specifically to help deliver immune support. Yeah, I always like to say, because uh, we always have like a lot of customers that always ask us, uh, you know, what else can I be doing in addition to treating with Emuade Max for my nail fungus? What else can I be doing? The biggest thing is do things that are going to support your immune system. So that's going to be a healthy diet, healthy lifestyle. You want to incorporate all of that. And the biggest thing we can also offer with our product line is our first defense probiotic. This probiotic was specially developed to help support the immune system for all of these difficult to treat skin conditions that we do treat. So this is a great addition into your treatment regimen uh, for those three times a day. You take this once a day, you can take it in the morning or you can take it at night. Um, Again, it's not required, but it's just a recommendation. The Emuate alone, the ointment, will work on your nail fungus. This is just trying to treat the whole body, a more holistic approach. One of the other things I wanted to point out is we've been asked before about nail polish. Women, you cannot polish your nails and effectively treat your nail fungus. I am so sorry to report that, but it's the truth. The shellac of the nail polish makes it virtually impossible for us to have that the ability to penetrate into the nail bed to treat the fungal infection. It also creates an environment where the fungus can kind of thrive. So unfortunately, Nail polish is a no-no. Do not paint your nails while you are treating nail fungus. Also, be careful at the nail salon. Pedicures are one of the very common ways to spread and acquire a nail yeah. fungal infection. So if you are not treating a nail fungus infection, but you get regular pedicures, I recommend using Emuate as a prophylactic. Put it on your toenails, even if they're healthy, to prevent the potential of acquiring a fungal infection on your nails. Um, it's just a matter of, 
you know, it's the facts. 20% of the U.S. population has now fungus. So it's a pretty common condition, and it's easily... It's, it's easily spread. Yes. It's, it, fungus is the type of condition that it, it can spread from, you know, person to person fairly easily. That's why, you know, if you're in the showers um, in a gym or anything, they always say wear closed-toed shoes. It's for fungal infections for that reason. So, again, anywhere your feet are, you know, wearing open-toed shoes or barefoot in places, you want to be extra, extra careful to, um, you know, prevent that fungal infection or to prevent it getting worse. Um, and then just to help your treatment in general, um, you know, to prevent any kind of new infection from getting in there. So hopefully we've uh, answered some of your questions about nail fungus and how to use EmuAid to treat nail fungus and the symptoms of nail fungus. Um, if you have any questions, you can always reach out to us on our website at emuaid.com through our chat, live chat, or call our customer care department and our customer care representatives can help you with any questions you may have. And if you have any ideas on any other Facebook uh, videos that you'd like to get to, for us to do or things to talk about, let us know. And yes, we uh, love hearing from you. Uh, our customers are our lifeline. We develop these products. I, you know, I, I'm assuming we all, we all develop these products because we want to help people. We love helping people. Um, that's why I came to this company. So if there's anything we can help you with, please let us know. Thanks. Bye. Thanks, you guys. Have a good one.